Okay, this is a differential equations question from C4, January 2012, question 5. Um, it's the same, this would come up in your, this type of question can come up in your A21 uh, pure mathematics exam. So it says solve a differential equation and it is cos squared of 4x dy by dx is equal to y. What we've got to do is separate the variable. So let me just write down this question again. We've got cos squared of 4x dy by dx is equal to y. Now the way I like to think of it is you want to get a function of y uh, times your dy by dx is equal to a function of x times your dx. So what I'm going to do, first of all, I'm going to bring this dx across. So I'm going to leave my dy. My dx is going to go across here. My y is going to go across, so it's now going to be 1 over y. And my cos squared is going to go across, so it's going to be 1 over cos squared of 4x. And then you put an integration sign, and that makes it all mathematically correct. If you integrate that, integrate to your left-hand side, you're going to get ln of y. And you have a plus c, but you don't bother with the plus c because you could put your plus c over of this side just. And then before we uh, do that, let's just change what this looks like here. Uh, 1 over cos squared is the same as sec squared of 4x dx. And then if we, we should know that if you integrate sec squared, you get tan. And that just comes from if you differentiate tan, you get sec squared. So it's actually going to be 1 over 4 tan of 4x and then plus your constant of integration c. Okay, we are told here, it says given, uh, what do we do? Solve the differential equation. So that means you've got to find basically y is equal to or something like that. So uh, you're told that y is it when y is equal to uh, e to the power of 3, your x is equal to pi over 16. So we're going to put that in here. Uh, so that's what we've got. So just say when y is equal to e to the power of 3, your x is equal to pi over 16. So let's just put that in and see what you've got. So you've got lin of e to the power of 3 is equal to 1 over 4 times tan of 4 times pi over 16 is just going to be pi over 4. Okay, now I've never learned these in terms of uh, your radians and so on. Uh, pi over 4, but it's the same as, um, pi over 4 is the same as as 45 degrees and tan of 45 degrees we should know that tan of 45 degrees is 1 if you don't know this put your calculator in radians mode do tan of pi over 4 and you'll get uh, tan of pi over 4 and you'll get 1 so that's what you've got and on over here that is the same uh, remember your rules of logs you can bring that 3 down the power down so it's lin it's uh, 3 times lin of e and lin of e is just one, so that's just gonna be three on this side is equal to a quarter plus c, which means two and three quarters is equal to your c, and then write your equation again. What are we gonna have? What was it? It was lin of y is equal to one quarter tan of four x plus two and three quarters. And I would imagine that is enough for you. It just says solve the differential equation. That's the differential equation solved. You could write it, I suppose, you could write it, I reckon that would give you your marks, but you could write it, and you're not going to lose marks for doing this, you could write that as e to the power of, um, sorry, e to the power of 1 quarter tan of 4x plus 2 and 3 quarters. That's not really much benefit of doing that. Uh, I would probably leave it, uh, leave well alone with the, the previous version.